<clears throat> hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to another Card Friday. Today I'm opening a excuse me, brand new product. Just came out today. Mimikyu EX box. Now, as with most of these boxes, let me grab my sleeves. Stay prepared with the sleeves. Um, as with most boxes, can't really show it all on camera conveniently from the way that I record, but it's fine. It's whatever. Uh, you can see the contents once I fully open it up. Bazinga. Oh. So, this box comes with the following. A Grievard hollow promo. This is just a Scarlet Violet base set card, similar to the starters from the Paldea collections that weren't on the main ones. So, Quaxlane, Sprigatito, and Foy Coco box. Uh, Sprigatito and uh, Foy Coco and the Quaxley box. Yeah, you get the idea. My cat is asking to get into my room. I don't think so. Um,. So yeah, this is just a hollow version of a regular common from Scarlet and Violet Base Set. Still kind of cool, still gonna sleeve it, just, just for funsies. And then the real, the real, um, attraction. Mimikyu EX. Lowercase, EX. Now this one is actually a promo. It's promo number four. Pretty nice. This is, as far as I know, the first English Scarlet and Violet EX card released. And then, of course, there's the jumbo version with the really nice hollow pattern um, of the Mimikyu. And then, the packs, which, you know, much like the starter collections, I didn't buy this for the packs. They're just kind of a nice bonus for me, but... For my Foy Coco and Coridon box, I got some pretty good luck. Hoping that I can repeat today. The packs are Brilliant Stars, Lindsay Cat, Fusion Trek, Insect, Silver Tempest, and Silver Tempest, both Reggie Drago. The art on the packs is not consistent, but whatever. Opening up some Silver Tempest first. Okay, white code card, that's all right. Still a possibility of a Radiant Pokemon, or what I'm hoping for more, a Trainer Gallery. Hopefully a Trainer Gallery that's not Rock Rough. So I've pulled that card like three or four times now. Forgot to do Guess the Energy, it is Fire. I totally was going to guess Fire. Fire Energy, Stone Junior. Golbat for a Soda Girl. Litten. Fampy. Feebas. Dratini. Whalmer. Reverse Hollow Litten. Alright, alright. I like Litten. Kind of, I guess. And Melodic. My brother likes Litten. So I might give that to him. I'll open up Brilliant Stars next. Pretty good set. And it is a black code card. Which guarantees at least a hollow. I'm gonna guess Water Energy. Never mind, it was a B-Star token. I always forget to guess that. 
we go. Pack numero dos. Clang. Cynthia's ambition. I do see something here. Torkoal. It could be in my imagination, but I'm pretty sure I see something. Elect the Buzz. Chime Echo. Gibble. That's a nice gibble. It's not like a... That looks like... Uh, the rock type city. The first city in Sinal. Uh, I can't remember. Uh, it's gonna be bugging me now. Turtwig! Yay! He's just a little guy. I keep refocusing the camera because I feel like it's not focusing, but I'm pretty sure it actually is, and it's just me going crazy. Shrapinch. Reverse Hallow Halucha. That is just a reverse common. Pretty good art of Halucha, though. And Honchkrow V. Nice. I don't have this. Um, Just a regular V, not super exciting. I pulled the alt art of this, actually, um, on TCG Online. That was pretty cool. Wish I could have pulled it in real life. I mean, I don't think it's worth a crazy amount, but... It's cool to pull. No matter how much it's worth, alt arts are nice. I'm gonna open the second Silver Tempest pack now. Black code card. Here it is. Gonna be a second. If you don't know, um, I bought back in, I'll say January is when that came out. Like early January. Um, Grass Energy. Flaming. Um, I bought a Foy Coco and Coridon Paldea collection box and pulled a Golden Lugia V Star. Tox Specs. Genius. So. Toxicroak. Hopefully I have good luck, just in general, with these, um, pre-Scarlet Violet releases. Litton. Fampy. Feebas. Dratini. Wilmer. Reverse Commons Drivis. And... What? You have got to be kidding me, dude! No way! I- that was stuck to the mischievous, too. I- I swear I didn't, like, plant that there. Oh my gosh. It- What? Hold on, I'm gonna grab a top loader. Absolutely freaking no way. That's just crazy. That's a what? Man. I I don't even play Lugia. I think that's what this is. I think it's the it's it's the universe trying to send me a sign that I should play Lugia V Star. And I'm sending a sign back. The sign says no, I'm not playing Lugia V Star. I'm not playing that meta trash. <laughs> Well, actually, it's not trash. That's why I don't like it. it. Yeah, I don't even know what to say, honestly. Other than, let's move on to Fusion Strike pick. I think he can really beat that. Metal Energy. Oh. Don't show the code. It's white. Oh, yeah, Metal Energy. Fighting. Um, I don't believe... Yeah, there's no training gallery here, so I'm not going to get anything good. Frostmoth. Sponge Gloves. Excadrill, Skarmory, more Pico, pretty cute, pretty cute, Clampero, that's a nice Clampero art, Caravana, Hey. okay, I really like this miracle, this is uh, one of my favorite cards, my eighth favorite, very nice, reverse charger bug, well, <laughs> You know, if I was opening Crown Zenith, a charge bug in the reverse house spot would be very exciting. 
because it'd be radiant charge bug, but this is just a reverse uncommon. And Hollow Steelix from a white code card pack. That all right? Okay. Nice. Nice. Not as nice as freaking Gold Lugia. Oh, this doesn't need sleeve actually. Not as nice as how? Literally how? That's just yeah. I don't know. I got I got nothing. See you next week. I guess I'm gonna go play Big Rod in Splatoon.